Asthma action plans are made with your asthma team, either at the GP surgery or at the hospital. They tell you which medications you need take each day to stay well. They also let you know what to do if you are feeling less well with your asthma, including coughing, wheezing, waking at night, feeling breathless, or have an emergency. It is important you feel able to understand your own asthma action plan. If you have difficulty in understanding it or reading the text, let your team know so the information can be given in a different way. You can ask for one to be made at any time if you do not already have one. It is available in many languages. Take it with you to your asthma appointments if you can. Be sure to keep it safe and consider showing it to your family or carers so they know what to do in an emergency as well. It can be useful to check peak flow readings. Peak flow scores can change depending on factors such as age, gender and height. The peak flow score is often slightly lower in the morning. It is useful to check readings when you are getting better from an asthma attack or if your medication has been changed. It may also help find what your triggers are. For instance, if there is a high pollen count and you are allergic to pollen, you may find your peak flow drops. Try to take it at the same time and before you use your asthma medication. Knowing what your best peak flow is can be helpful and your asthma team can use this to draw up a set of recommendations. If your peak flow drops, you will need to follow the steps in your action plan and seek help, either by calling your GP surgery or 111 out of hours. Sometimes your symptoms may flare up despite your peak flow being normal, and if you are worried at all, despite your peak flows being normal, it is okay to ask for help. In certain circumstances, such as during an asthma attack, it may not be possible to do your peak flow because of breathlessness. If your reliever inhaler does not help your symptoms during an attack, you may need to call 999. Please watch one of our videos on taking a peak flow reading for further support.